Hello lovelies, it's Heidi from Wyatt Bibliophile here with this week's In My Mailbox. Now it's Saturday afternoon and I literally just got home from um, Naperville. I mean like I walked to the door, I put on pajama pants and now I'm filming this video. Um, I was down there on Friday night, I saw Veronica Roth and then this afternoon, Saturday, um, I saw Kristen Kishore. And so I, um, it was, I had a great time, it was really really exciting and I want to share with you some books that um, I bought a number of books this week and I also got some in the mail um, for Veronica's Ross who's their signing insurgent so obviously I bought a copy of that um, I actually have already read it I read an arc and then she also had stickers for all the different factions there so I got those um, in my beautiful finished copy of insurgent from um, Anderson's bookshop. I also for the for the Kristen Kishore signing I got a finished copy of Bitter Blue. Um, again I had already read it and that review is in my vlog as well. And then I also bought um, a paperback copy copy of Graceling uh, that I had her sign. Um, she just signed it not to anyone personally. Um, oh there it is. So this is going to be a giveaway on my vlog. I'm not sure when but I love her books so I wanted to buy more of them. So I got those this weekend. Also this weekend, um, and this isn't bookish at all, but I wanted to share it because it's the coolest thing ever and I'm so excited that I found them. But they had these Doctor Who sticky notes at um, Anderson's has another shop called Two Doors Down. Um, it's Doctor Who Thought Regenerators, it says on the side. When you open it up, oh my gosh, there's the TARDIS sticky notes um, and a bunch of Daleks. And then this one, it says to do, time, and dimension with the Doctor. Um, and I'm super excited about these and I'm a total geek, I know, but that's like my favorite buy of the weekend, not even any of the books that I got. Um, also, okay, this week I also got a couple more in the mail. Um, one is Shine by Jerry Smith Riley. This is the third time this is in my mailbox because I borrowed an ARC from my friend Lynn. Um, and then Simon Schuster sent me a paperback copy that I'm giving away on my blog. And then I ordered this one from Constellation Books, so it's signed to me. And then she also, I also got a signed Keeley Brothers um, sticker and a couple signed Shine bookmarks. So I'm super excited about that one. Again, I've read it, um, but now I have the whole beautiful series. Um, and then I bought a copy of City of Fallen Angels, which I already own and have read, um, but I'm going to see Cassandra Clare on Tuesday at her launch for City of Lost so um, Souls in, in Naperville again. Um, and I loaned this copy out and I can't find it. So I need to have all of her books to bring to get signed. So I, are, I bought a copy of that. Um, those are all the books I bought this week. I did receive some in the mail. Um, this one is actually one that was returned to me, but I didn't show it to you before. When I was at the Romantic Times conference, um, I got a, a grab bag, because I'm a librarian. Um, and in it, I got a copy of The Golden Lily, which is the second book in the Bloodline series by Rochelle Mead, which is a follow-up series to um, Vampire Academy. <laughs> so um, The Golden Lily, so Jen just sent it back to me. Um, also, I'm on a blog tour for the book Reunited. So Simon Schuster sent us a copy um, in the mail this week, and I'll be giving this away um, when I do my blog post for that. I believe it's in June. Also from Simon & Schuster, um, I got a finished copy of When You Were Mine, which I'm excited about. I've been hearing lots of really great things about this one. Um, and so yeah, I'm excited. This, this is what I'll probably be reading this summer, and it came with a, um, a little a bookmark. So thank you again to Simon & Schuster. Uh, and then a couple things that I got from some authors who are totally awesomely amazing. I met Elizabeth Scott um, at an event in September and we were talking about just schools and libraries and we have a local alternative school in our district for kids who don't do well in mainstream schooling and they don't have a library. Um, these are kids that I think really need access to books. And so she sent me a box of uh, Between Here and Forever. And I just wanted to show it to you guys because I thought that was so awesome of her. Um, I was able to donate some to the public library, the high school, the alternative school, and have some in my school. Um, and so that was just so generous and I really appreciate it. So thank you, Elizabeth. And then today, you guys, when I got home, I just got my mail and I totally did a little happy dance in the elevator because I had this package. And I was like, who is this from? Where? Wait, what did I... Like, my mind was blank, and I didn't realize that the return address said Jordan, and I was thinking it was a first name, I'm like, who the heck is Jordan? And, oh no, it's from Sophie Jordan, and it's hidden. I'm so excited, you guys. This is the third and final Firelight. I love this series. I love Sophie's books, and um, so she sent me an advanced copy of Hidden, because she is wonderful, and then in that, um, there's also a bookmark for Terrell and Child's series, and then um, she sent me a whole stack of bookmarks for her series, because she knows how much my students love them. Um, and so I am thrilled. Thank you so much to Sophie Jordan. Um, you are awesome and I cannot wait 
to sit down and read this book. I took Tuesday and Wednesday off of this week to go to the Cassandra Clare signing. Um, and I know I'll have some extra time, so this book is definitely coming with me. Um, if you've not read the Firelight books, you really should. Um, Firelight Vanish and then Hidden is the final one. Um, so yeah, that is my totally awesomely wonderfully amazing week in books. I hope you got some good things as well. Um, and yeah, support support your local independent bookstores. Anderson's does some pretty awesome things and I'm really lucky that I'm able to go down there and attend these events. So thanks again to Anderson's. Bye.